Hi, today's recipe will be the chicken curry for those who are on dialysis. Let's get cooking. Hey, I'm Jonathan Diaz, registered dietitian, and I've been working with patients on dialysis for the past five years and more to come. So, uh, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I post recipes for those who are on dialysis because as many of you may or may not know, the diet is very confusing. What was once healthy, now it's not, and what was once not healthy, now is. So, for example, if you're on dialysis, now, now you can take in more protein. That's right. So if you only have kidney damage, but not damage to the point where you need dialysis, you need less protein. But on dialysis, you need a lot more protein. So the diet does change, and I'm here to help you with that. So I have a recipe here, chicken curry, which I've done before. A link up here somewhere. It'll send you to my old uh, chicken curry. That was a pretty good recipe, I'm not gonna lie. But this one is definitely much better. I prefer this one better than that one. And it's very simple to do. And before I continue, please follow my Instagram, TikTok, and not I'm I'm so sorry see I, I suffer from short-term memory loss Facebook <laughs> Facebook links right here uh, I'll put it in the description down below and it's also in the about section of my YouTube channel there you get more tips on uh, products that are good and bad for you so today's dish is gonna be the chicken curry so I definitely use got chicken. I'm using chicken in there it's already marinating marinating with the, all the sauces and the, and the seasoning, which is gonna be this. So what's marinating the chicken there is pepper, some turmeric, curry powder, salt, and coconut milk, full fat coconut milk. So that's what this little plate is right here. This plate right here is all of this combined and you let it marinate with the chicken overnight or for a few minutes. It's best to have it overnight so the chicken can really absorb all those flavors. The reason why I'm using coconut milk, as many of you may or may not have heard, you've been told coconut has, coconut has a lot of potassium. The coconut water does. It's very concentrated. Uh, the coconut milk has a lot less, especially if you read the label, it even tells you, it doesn't say it's less, but the number is definitely smaller. So go for full fat coconut milk. It has definitely a little bit less salt and is flavorful. And it makes the chicken very moist. If you like moist chicken, whole fat coconut milk, is the way to go. And yeah, I'm getting so hungry. Let's, let's start cooking already. <laughs> all right, so you pour in that Goya coconut milk first and then all the dry seasoning, the spices. And you're gonna mix it really well just because we want, we do not want any lumps and we want the chicken to be covered in this sauce. And when you cut, well, dice up the chicken, try to dice them up evenly so when it all cooks, it cooks at the same time and the chicken curry will be ready. And then throw it in the bowl, mix it really well, play with that chicken, because I love to play with food. <laughs> Put the lid on and then refrigerate it for as long as you want, at least 30 minutes. And then on high heat, put in that oil and then put in the chicken. Not the sauce, just the chicken. Cook it on high. And while that's cooking on high for about 10 minutes, then we cook, put it on low. But before that, we're gonna get some of that sauce that we didn't get earlier, put some water. Get every bit of it because we want to make sure that this chicken tastes like curry. And then you pour it all in the in this oh, in the pot and cook it on low medium for another 20 minutes and boom. There you have it. This chicken curry. Oh my goodness. And uh, yeah, I guarantee you this will make your house smell well like curry. It's so fragrant. And this will not disappoint you. I guarantee you that. So Please don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and notification bell to not miss any new content I post every Friday. Well, every other Friday. And again, thank you again for all your likes, your views, your comments, the shares. That really does help my channel so much. Please continue to do so because I really do appreciate that. Thanks again, and I pray that your dialysis treatment goes very well. Bye.